Good morning, students. Today uh, we are going to learn how to plot IV curve for a capacitor for a given voltage ramp. Okay, so I have a capacitor whose value is equal to two microfarads. Okay, so this capacitor is given whose capacitance value is, is two microfarad. So now across this capacitor, I am applying a belt a voltage wave waveform. Okay. So this is I'm applying a voltage waveform. Okay. So this is my time axis, and this is my voltage axis in volts, and time is in seconds. Okay. So T is equal to zero to T is equal to one. My voltage increases. It goes up to two volts, and after one to two seconds. Okay. So now again voltage get decreases okay so during this time i want to plot iv curve for a capacitor okay so how to do this so first of all what i will do i will write the voltage equation okay so we can i write okay so it's increasing so i can write v equals to 2t volts between time interval from 0 to 1 okay so 0 to one second okay after that part happen so when t is equal to zero voltage is zero when t equal to one okay my voltage is two okay now in second case i can write two minus t volts okay between t is equal to zero one second to t equal to two seconds okay so if i put here t equal to two okay so voltage is zero okay if i put t equal to one okay so two minus one okay again two volts okay so this this equation satisfies this voltage wave flow and now i want to calculate iv curve okay so we know for any capacitor this equation is valid that is q equal to cv now if i want to measure the uh, current so current can be given by simply i c dv upon dt okay so if i want to measure the current in the capacitor i need to know the scan rate dv by dt is a voltage voltage chain okay the scan rate okay so now i can measure this dv upon dt from here okay so this is i'm writing here v okay so dv upon dt dv upon dt will be so if i so dv upon dt will be constant to for time period 0 to 1 second and it will be minus 2 volts minus 2 volts for time period from 1 second to 2 second okay so now i know dvdt in this time interval i can easily i can know capacitance value i can easily calculate the current okay so what will the current values so my current will be simply 2 okay c dv upon dt okay so 2 into this dv upon dt so my current will be simply 4 into 10 s to power minus 6 ampere for the period of 0 to t 1 and in second interval my current will be minus 4 into 10 s to power minus 6 ampere for time period 1 to t equals to Two, okay now i know the current okay i know the voltage how voltage is changing okay now i need to calculate uh, i have voltage equation i have current equation now i want to cal calculate iv curve okay so how can i plot the iv curve now so so now this is my i okay this is my i and this is my voltage axis okay so i know when voltage is voltage is increasing okay so voltage go up to two volts okay so when voltage is increasing in that time that interval i have a constant current so this is my i value okay and again when this interval voltage is decreasing if i'm moving from if i'm moving again here if time is increasing one okay t is equal to 1 the voltage is 2 volts okay and t is equal to 2 second the voltage is 0 okay so voltage is decreasing the scan rate is negative okay the scan rate is negative that's why we have negative current here so in second interval okay 
so this this is a voltage axis okay this is not time axis this is a voltage axis so when a voltage is 2 volts okay my current is this this one from 0 to 0 to 2 volts and again when my voltage is decreasing okay so current is negative because current is negative okay so the current value is same value okay so here we have 4 4 into 10 is to power minus 6 ampere okay and here i have current value minus 4 into 10 is to power minus 6 ampere okay that means for given constant scan rate okay so this for this ramp okay my iv curve will be like this box okay so the iv curve will be like is a rectangular box okay